Hi, my name is Johnson Go. I'm a senior scientist at the Institute of Materials Research and Engineering in ASTAR. I'm trying to build quantum computers using uh, 2D materials. The whole concept of quantum computing relies on just two ideas. Uh, the first one is uh, superposition, second one is entanglement. Right? With one qubit, you demonstrate superposition. With two qubits, you can demonstrate entanglement. So once you have, in terms of technology, for showing you can perform superposition as well as entanglement, people will believe that you have the basic unit for building up a big quantum computer. The proof of the pudding for any qubit uh, competitor competing technology is you need to build a single qubit gate, but that single qubit gate only gives you one bit of information. Then you need a second one because you need the second qubit right, to be able to show you can entangle two. Then my team will have the two qubit gates built and measured. As a schoolboy, I was leading a double life trying to get A's in school, but at the same time, I was excited about doing all these projects that I have at home, all these crazy projects that I kept trying and trying. But sad to say, many of them failed. But nevertheless, I went on because it's this kind of experience that built the resilience and the fortitude in me to be a researcher. Yeah, most of the people I've spoken to feel that quantum is deep, it's difficult, it's beyond reach. And quantum is not easy. Right? And many scientists I know would tell you quite honestly they don't understand everything about quantum. I don't want to dumb it down, but I want to convey this message to you and everyone that uh, quantum is exciting. I would like you to see it as the next theme park that you should go to. In going there together, we can create a new future based on quantum. So I didn't quite succeed. I managed to get the screen up. Uh, you know, I was basically trying to build a Space Invader game, um, the shooting oh, game. Shooting. Yes.